The sisters have the right. Inside the home, they are in charge. Don't come home with your chest poked out. Where's the food? What's going on? Blah, blah. Go get this. Why you didn't? Be quiet. Leave the sister alone. Don't tell her what kind of curtains. Don't tell her what to do. Don't tell her what to fix. Don't tell her so she don't have to do nothing for you. Nothing. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, Ar-rijal kawamuna ala nisa. This don't mean that you are the commander of the women. No, you have responsibility to them. She don't even have to work. She don't have to lift a cup. She don't have to do any work. She don't have to, she don't have to clean your clothes. She don't have to iron your clothes. She don't have to wash no dishes. She don't have to cook no food for you. She don't have to do anything. This is not her job. If you want somebody to do that, go hire a servant. But if she does that, this will be a blessing for her in front of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. When you marry her, this don't mean you have a slave, you got a servant. If she does it for you, this is a nafil for her. This is good for her. She should do that to want to serve her husband, to, to obtain his pleasure. Because the pleasure of the husband is next to what? The pleasure of Allah. The displeasure of the husband is next to the displeasure of Allah.